guys, Battle Systems here. I'm Colin. I'm Stuart. And we have got for you here an example. If you're buying any crews, uh, expansion crews, a crew booster from uh, Battle Systems, then this is an example of what you're going to get in a book, uh, box. And it's really, really cool. And uh, Stuart can tell you all about it. Yep. So, as you'll see on the back of the box, there is more than just the miniatures in here. Uh, all of this stuff is inside the box. So, I will show you. Love these crew boxes. They're really, really cool. So on the top here, you'll see that you get four character boards, there's one for each character in there, and you'll also get a class board. Like all of the ones in the core game, these are all double-sided, so you've got these four new characters you can use as a crew. You can also use them as civilians, so if you're playing with the crew out of the core game, you can just have some extra civilians running around using these new stats. Class boards are also double-sided, so you've got some options of how you uh, equip your characters. And of course, when it's in, when, when you're playing it as traders, they fit in the little dashboards that you get, which come in the game, yeah. um, or you can buy as a booster as well, um, and uh, along with the class boards and everything now. So, so everything's kind of held in one place, which is really yeah. cool. Yeah. Also, with these characters, you can play them as a crew on their own, or you can mix and match them with the core game crews or any of the others. So if you've got your favourite characters, you can just choose those. And some of this equipment on here as well, because you're going to get extra equipment. You know, there's some extra ammo packs and things that you might see, but there's also specialist equipment in the that you can only get inside these crews. So we've got things like specialist armour just for this particular character. We've got new weapons. That, new types of grenade. Yeah, exactly, that you won't necessarily get um, uh, in any other crews, um, as it were. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, even some unique armour and stuff, which matches up the particular character, which is really cool. Sounds cool. Yeah. So those are your character boards. Uh, you've also got the equipment tokens on the bottom, as Colin said. Then you'll see each crew booster comes with a little rule book. Now you don't necessarily need extra rules for the crews because they all work with what you get in the core game, but this just gives you an overview of what's in the box. So you've got some extra event cards, equipment, everything like that. Anything that is new to what was in the core game will be highlighted here. The rules are in the rule book anyway, but just as a reminder, there's a few, like the extra grenades you get on there, just as a reminder what the icons on that mean, um, so it can refresh your memory. That's it for rules, but what you get next is a new mission. Uh, and this is something where we've gone back through the story of this crew, looked at their history and picked out a key event that we want to represent in Core Space. So you've got an introduction story here, and then here is their mission. Just like all the ones in the core game, you've got a mission set up, how to uh, start the hostility, what you put in your crates, everything like that. A load of special rules that can make this really interesting uh, and different to all the other missions you've played. And it is specific to this crew. Certainly. But there's rules in here that you can play it with any crew if you want to. Great. Then you can learn a bit more about the characters. So you've got Captain Sondar here, for example, and the rest of his crew and their ship, Cygnus. Uh, a bit of background on how they work. Cool. And then finally on the back, just a closing story to finish off that mission. That's that. Next, you will get a deck of event cards. These can go straight into the event deck with the ones in the core game. But now you've got this crew, you've got a few extra options. So these cards with the little hand icon, they're assistance cards. Uh, when these come out, instead of something bad happening and ruining your game, which, which does happen, which does happen a lot, uh, these ones are generally things that will help you out. So this one, for example, is a flash bomb. You found a way to um, hack into the lighting system and it allows you to overload it and have some special effects from that. Oh, foresight, for example, you can uh, look at different event cards and keep them to yourself and play them later. You'll also get another environment card, which will just mix up how uh, the game works as you go through. Finally, of course, you will get your miniatures. You get four of these. these each crew. This is the best part, as always. It's all about miniatures. You get four <laughs> miniatures in each crew. Everyone is a unique sculpt. They're all in the same high quality plastic that you get in the core game. So here's Chip, Team, Sondar, and Hunter. Yep. Um, they will fit into the same colour clip bases you get in the game. Mix and match them as you want. Um, so yeah, those, these are really good. Yeah. yeah, so as you can see, you get a lot more than just a crew. Uh, you get basically a whole new way to play the game. Uh, in that just in just that small box i think yeah and i think it's really good and as we've probably mentioned before you know uh, various other videos um 
uh, you know, you can take all the components and they can go actually be stored into your uh, main core box as well. Uh, so you can keep them back in here or you can keep them in the main core box. So yeah. you've just got one box. You're going to go around your mates or you're going to go out at gaming night. It all fits in the core game retail box. Yeah. And then you can just go around, unpack it. You've not got multiple boxes and everything. Mm -hmm. So that's pretty cool as well. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, there you go. That's a good booster. Hope you enjoy that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Until the next one. See you later and happy gaming.